Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. This chapter talks about money. We are going to learn some words related to money and financial issues and some local currencies used in some communities. So the main objective of this chapter is to determine different words related to money. These words can be found in the vocabulary log. The words are bank, currency, banknote, popular, exchange, economy, decorative, coin, trading, check, warehouse, and credit. So now you are required to listen to the radio report about a town that has issued its own currency. Then answer the questions that follow. Hello and welcome to this week's edition of Your Money or Your Life. First, we're going to take a look at a movement that is becoming popular in small towns and communities across America, and that is the trend towards local currencies. That's right. Some small towns are issuing their own banknotes that are valid only in the local community. We have a report from Tom in Wilkes, Nebraska. Tom? Hi there. I'm here in Wilkes, and with me is Adrian Moore from the Chamber of Commerce. Hello, Adrian. Hi. Now, I'm holding a beautiful banknote. I just bought this at City Hall. It feels just like a regular dollar bill, but it's blue. And it has a beautiful picture of, I guess this is a lake? Yes, that's right. It's Lake Washington, um, about five miles from here. It's done by a local artist. Hmm, that's interesting. What other kinds of work might an anthropologist do in a corporate setting? That's right. What other notes are there? There's a one, a five, and a ten, plus a half hour and a quarter hour. Okay. So where can I spend this money? You can use it uh, just about everywhere. All the businesses downtown. Coffee shops, bookstores, uh, department stores. Plus you can use it for services. Building contractors, painters and decorators, nanny services, artists, uh, you name it. They'll accept this just as if it was a regular dollar bill or ten dollars? That's right. The money is legal tender wherever it's accepted. And how much money is in circulation? About 20,000 hours so far. Why did you decide to do this here in Wilkes? Well, the idea is to stimulate the local economy and to keep, mo keep money moving around the community. Uh, a lot of money was leaving town because people were spending it in chain stores that uh, came from out of state. We wanted to encourage shoppers to shop locally. And if you use your own currency that's different from the dollar, then it's easier for people to see where their money's going. How many businesses accept these? Oh, uh, more than 300. We, we publish a newsletter and we list all the businesses that accept the currency. And what do the businesses do with the money? I mean, can they cash it in or...? Well, they can cash it in, but that's not the objective. What we want to do is keep the currency in the community. Employers use it to pay part of their employees' salaries, or they pay for local services with it. So you see, it, it recirculates. It goes back into the community that way. The idea of local currency is not new. Americans have been doing it since before the American Revolution, and it's still popular. Apart from Wilkes, several other communities in the United States have also issued their own currency. There are Real dollars in Lawrence, Kansas, Valley dollars in Greenfield, Massachusetts, Greenbacks in Brooklyn, and in Canada they have Toronto dollars. I see that on the back of the bills is written, In Wilkes We Trust. It's really about trust in the community, isn't it? When you use these, you're trusting that they'll keep their value and that people will continue to accept them. I guess so. Yes, we're a very trusting community. From Wilkes, Nebraska, this is Tom Cohen for WXBC. Okay, let's start with question number one. 
and keep in your mind that I'm going to do only three questions with you and leave the rest to you to do. Number one, what picture is on the Wilkes banknote? Yes, according to the audio track, the picture was Lake Washington. It was Lake Washington. How about question number two? How much is one hour worth? So the city of Wilkes use its own currency, its own money. So how much is one hour worth? Yes, according to the audio track, one hour worth $10. Question number three, where can the money be used? So the Wilkes own currency can be used in what fields, in what uh, places? According to the audio track, Wilkes money can be used in all businesses and cafes and box store box stores thank you very much see you soon inshallah